This is Mike Bodick with Chip Ganassi Racing. Last time we talked about mag particle inspection. On this episode, we're gonna talk more about dye penetrant solution inspections. When we go over to the dye penetrant side, we use uh, a solution that is water soluble that we either brush on or dip the part in, rinse it off with tap water, and then dry it and inspect the part for also indications or cracks. Uh, the type of materials that we use that are in the dye penetrant type are your titanium, aluminum, anything that's non-magnetic, even plastics or other types of uh, non-magnetic type parts. So in dye penetrant inspection, one of the most important parts is always starting with a clean uh, part that you want to inspect. Very critical. Dirty parts, they don't inspect very well and it causes you to do twice the work. We'll physically dip it or, depending on the part, we'll brush it on. It will then set for between 20 and 30 minutes, what is also known as dwell time, where the dye penetrant will find its way into porosities or any other cracks or indications as they're known. After 20 minutes, it will go to the rinse tank. We then just take normal tap water. This is water soluble. And we'll just rinse this part gently. So after 30 minutes in the drying oven, we'll pull our piece out. It's ready for inspection. So as you can see, threaded areas are not indications. But if we flip this over, all these highlighted areas right there, so again, this will get a red tag. We'll take proper pictures and documentation and it won't see a race car again for the rest of its life. 